For the last couple of days, we've been opening our garden to raise money for the British Red Cross. 2011, um, if I think back, we actually opened the garden for the National Garden Scheme. So from then on, we've always actually opened the garden every year to, uh, for charity events. Um, so it's just something we've always done. I saw it on uh, Gardener's World some, I'm not sure how many years ago, and I made a note of it because I realised it was within driving distance and I've just been checking and waiting for an open day that we could come to. It's stunning. <laughs> it's, uh, it's wonderful. We've really enjoyed walking around. It's been super. Well, we love going down the paths and as you're going down the paths it's beautiful because you find something new at every corner. I loved it. Yeah, it's very, very pretty. It's interesting to see which things the bees like best. It's a very naturalistic, wild place and I think it's quite important for people to see that you can have a garden that isn't necessarily um, manicured and it also allows you to, to sort of let nature in and um, to be able to share that with people is, is really, really lovely. I just think the setting for the pool and the surrounding area is absolutely beautiful and it changes every every time you come, there's improvements, um, more things to see, I just think it's wonderful. And the pool area for me is another reason for coming, just to see it, just to see all the beautiful water lilies and everything you, know, you can sit and it's just so pretty. It changes from year to year doesn't it and just watching everything grow and flourish and just being around nature. It's just a lovely tranquil place to visit. <laughs> what is great about it is that people clearly enjoy it, value the experience, leave feeling refreshed and positive. So it's a good, it's a good day. We've had over 300 people here in two days and obviously we've, we've raised a huge amount of money for the, for the British Red Cross. Um, we've also managed to help a little bit for the hedgehogs as well, which is always, always really nice to help local charities. Um, you know, that's just down to incredible volunteers, some of our staff doing loads of baking in their own time and helping out. So yeah, it's been, I think it's been a lovely day um, in general because everyone's enjoyed themselves, lovely visitors who enjoy being in a garden and enjoy wildlife and we are exhausted <laughs> but it's definitely been worthwhile, yeah. We'll do it again. <laughs>